First of all, hello. Would you like to? Well, I would like you to introduce yourself to our to our readers and viewers here. Talkingmakeup.com. My name is Luc Bouchard. I'm with Mac Cosmetics, and we're backstage at Twee. Fabulous. So, uh, what's the look today? What's the? Yeah. The look is very simple. It's about a burst of color. It's kind of a coral on the lid, and then a strong extended brow. And then the lip is kind of faded out, and there's a little bit of a kind of a pinkish contour as well, and that's it. Very satiny skin, you know, very simple. Fabulous, and what, the inspiration for, for the look and the... Well, actually, we were looking for to use one color because the collection is kind of lots of muted tones and all that, and we wanted a color that would be powerful and kind of bring everything to life. And that's why we picked to the coral on the eyes especially, so that we have kind of a strong color burst of color, and then it blends with the clothes. And to achieve that coral around the eyes, what MAC products are you going to use tonight? We use, actually... <laughs> A new product that's not out yet, which is it's a mix of paint stick. It's a magenta, yellow, and, and white, you know, to basically make a coral by yourself. So it's a creamy texture that we set with prep and prime powder so that it stays put. But it still keeps that kind of, um, I don't know, just like naturally cream, like skin-like feeling, even if it's a bright color. What would you advise to a woman that wants to use color? Keep her style in makeup? Uh, you know, sometimes it's just uh, if you have a liner, a black liner, and then you just do a little bit of color close to uh, your lid, it just allows you to bring the color in without changing everything. Right? It just gives a little burst of color. Yeah? You can do it with paint stick, it's a bit more complicated, it's more of work. But we also use this for a blush, which is an eyeshadow, so you could use that. That's the breath, baby breath, which is a word. But it, it's, kind of, <clears throat> it's kind of a corally pink. And you know, with a black liner, you can do that, and it just kind of brightens up everything and wakes everything up. It's really a simple way to make your face kind of glow. And tell me, when you see the clothes, and you, you're obviously inspired by the clothes, you're trying to match the colors, or you're trying to just go your way and add something? It varies a lot, but in this case, what we were trying to, is make, to do is make the colors of the clothes pop because of the, the color of the shadow, right? Because they were all more muted tones and like beautiful soft tones. We wanted something that was kind of powerful to wake everything up. So are, are you adapting the colors also to the colors of the model, her eyes maybe? You have to a little bit, but we're trying to have kind of a uniform look, right? So the extended brow is kind of what brings everything back and then the corally eye. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you so much.